that's not all. As you all know, tragically, Hi everyone. the king so what has to play no next? heirs. Bring everything that is so awesome in gaming. This position could very well lead to the crown of Daventry itself. Now, let's officially commence the competition part of the tournament. You're here for a tournament. I do hope you've all made friends, because it's about to get nasty. The time has come to collect your entrance tickets. Oh, uh, oh over here! Over here, I got mine right here! I'm sorry, I really am, but that is not an entrance ticket. In fact, from up here, it looks like a, a sweaty piece of cloth. Oh, probably just a snot rag. You're not going to let me go forward? <laughs> Each night hopeful will need to bring back to the theater. Dum -dum -dum -dum. One, One eye, eye of the hideous, hideous beast. beast. And due to Proclamation 1748.2, it will actually need to be a hideous beast. What were the other like options? Last year. Oh. No adorably cute, fuzzy, or tiny creature eyes will be accepted. Thank Ew. you. <laughs> Nothing to see here. There are many hideous eyes to find in Daventry. We urge you to take this opportunity so to you're show in us your skills. We want to know what's in your heart, how you think, and how you react in the face of danger. You might not believe all that can be interpreted from one eye, but we will still judge you all the same. Now, everyone, go forth and claim thine eyes. This is the most famous adventuring game in the universe. Whisper! Mm. Roberta, the Williams created this Whisper, for Sierra Games mm -mm. way back in the day. Um, what they did is they actually rebooted the games afterwards. Interesting. Um, with King's Quest 1. Uh, being the free chapter, and then from there you can move on to all the King's Quests. So it was surprising to us that they made a comeback, um, and there are some remasters floating around and so on from way back when licenses were able to expire on games. Watch your step, kid. Oh, thanks. I know it ain't fancy, but it'll have to work for now. Amaya Blackstone, nice to meet you. Graham, the pleasure's mine. It's nice to see all these bridges are getting fixed. All these bridges? No, kid. This contract is over. Daventry can't afford <laughs> me anymore. They can't even afford oil for the crumbler over there. My own invention, of course. Oh, what does a crumbler do? It lifts, it chops, it crumbles. Most importantly, it brings in the monies, which are desperately needed. Been kind of rough around here lately. It seems that way. Aww. Daventry's been an interesting experience so far. Different from what I read in my travel books. Honestly, I'm starting to wonder if it's for me. Don't worry, kid. It's not you. This kingdom's been going downhill ever since the Queen died. And now, with the bridges out, no one can get into Daventry. It's really quiet. I hate the silence. I'm a woman of action, if you couldn't tell. Quiet towns don't pay the bills. I can see that. Well, I should get going. Perhaps someone's wandered into my shop. If you make it there, come say hi. I'm on the left. So the king is dying. Um, they don't really mention that as much Keep in this out. Under construction. iteration of the game. Um, previously, what you did was go through and gather the three tre treasures and take over for the king. This time, they're kind of making Gosh, you fight your way through. Distress. Through. Um... Oh, wow, they're not going to let me back down by the wasp nest. Um, we so, already passed the dragon. How did you find an eye? By searching in the bushes. A hideous beast rushing inside. That's Gwendolyn, Graham's granddaughter. Um, we loved the fact that they did it as a retrospective. Um, so King Graham is getting on in his years, and his family comes to visit, bringing their granddaughter Gwendolyn. She wants to compete in a tournament against her cousin, which was a little bit of a curveball. Um, they did kind of blaze the trail for feminism. Can I look here? Shame. These could have been carved into really nice jack-o'-lanterns. And Grandpa loves to tell Gwendolyn her bedtime stories about how he became king, and then he's going to work his way eventually all the way through all of the king's quests. So you have this incredible princess bride element. That pumpkin was housing too many squirrels for my taste. Grandpa tops at two squirrels, no more than two. Now we found out that one of the competitors has a squirrel on his belly, so it's obviously... Going to come into play here. Hello, friend. I have to get these old picks before I can go home. 
Leave me be so I can finish my work. It's following a familiar adventure game format. Um, where you have your object interaction. It'll show you the scene if something will work there. So that was a really nice brush up there. Um, we have the puzzles it's setting up for us. All the horns are missing their mouthpieces. They're big fans of puns, um, but they do it in the traditional European style. So if you're familiar with fairy tales, you run into like nods to them. And they did the same thing with movies. A new kind of horn, but the same result. Um, where Grandpa's telling Gwendolyn a bedtime story, so they went and got Vizini to voice one of the knights. So you're against a Sicilian. Death is not yet on the line, but you do have to find a monster eyes, so they're ramping it up. They 100% do not, senor. 100%. Why can't I go where? I would have thought I could go to the left or right here. Whisper apparently is the only one who can do so. <laughs> um, I've got some sort of dock. Something with the frogs. Um, so basically what you do is what I'm doing right here. We go around and collect the puzzles first. Probably rolling in nostalgia if you have played the games. Um, because there's this odd mashup of new characters. Um, we did not previously know the blacksmith. Um, and old familiar um, characters phrased in a new way. So we know King Graham inside out, upside down and backwards. They have an obsession with squirrels. Precious. The badger wanted to make friends with the squirrels. Aw, honey badger don't care. Let's go die. Let's do that. Hold on, what's this? Oh, there is a standout stone. Uh, they were pixel hunters, so they did not just give this. Whoa! Get out of here! Scram! Shoot! Beat it! Good odds on her helping us since they did introduce her. Ugh, these dumb lanterns are always breaking. You hear that, Chester? You're a hack! Not everyone around here takes pride in their work like I do. Unfortunately, those blue flames are the only things that spook the pack. So I'm forced to return to their shop of wizardry and toiletries. Wedzel wolves are super aggressive this time of year. Usually, they travel north to the hills of Serenia for mating season. But like us, they are stranded here until the bridges are fixed. Oh no! Hey, kid, can you do me a favor? Sure. I can try. Can you help me keep that back door closed? I run the local Wedzel Wolf Watch program here in town. There's patches getting made. If you keep that door closed, you can be an official member. Think it over. Patches! My goodness. We could get hatches. So this is back out of the town. I walked into town with my last coin. Whatever path I chose to pursue for my eye would need to be cheap. Now we can go and get more of the lamps and see if we can get a wolf's eye. Also, this looks like the most interesting shop. So they make you make a choice at this point. Usually you die instead. That merchant is usually so prompt with our air, miraculous, and oftentimes delicious ingredients. Oh, horse feathers, Chester. This boy's no courier. He desires a position in King Edward's court. He <gasps> They're appears to be a compassionate gentleman, but he is clearly out of his convent zone. He is one who needs to think more with his brain and less with his heart if he is going to defeat the contenders in this year's night tournament. Zounds! Did you just read my fortune? No, we're just very old and very judgmental people. It's true, we're judges. This is my judging face. Ariel and I don't read fortunes anymore. Yeah, there was no future in it. Well, we've shifted our core business to potions, curiosities, and the occasional practical joke. <laughs> Uh, we gladly share our wisdom for free, but everything else starts at one shiny gold coin. So this is familiar for anyone who played King's Quest VI. Let us know if you like anything you see. You show up to save the princess and you wind up with all of one gold coin. Something mysterious and magical was brewing in that pot. It looked like some type of broken lantern. What are these little guys? 
Those are bird bombs. Oh, what old is... invention. Kind of like a smoke bomb, but they release gas that will cause your victim to cluck like a chicken. <laughs> Temporarily, of course. Those ones are expired, though, so they're just for display. Uh, can I have- might I have this? Oh, I just exited. Okay. So I can certainly ask for the you lantern. Our son. Yes, son. See if it'll take down a wolf. Do you have any eyes? And how much for the candle? Oh, how much for that candle? Our everlasting blue flame lantern? The housing's broken. Someone brought it in for repair but never paid. Tell you what. If you bring us something we can hollow out to house the candle, you Ooh, so can we can go and get the, the pumpkin. One shiny gold coin. Get it. All right, fairly well. So, I've just got to know, what is brewing in that cauldron? Is it a transfiguration elixir? Is it an invincibility potion? If I drink it, will I understand the language of creatures? Will I sprout the wings of an eagle? Or a fly? Oh, this? Teeth whitening potion. Oh, it's got to change everything. Watch this. Behold the power of whitening. Oh, well, oh, well, oh, well, we're still working out the kinks. While we're still in the prototype phase, feel free to dip whatever you want in there free of charge. My goodness, I really want to do that. Do you <laughs> have any eye. eyes of hideous beasts in stock? <gasps> we're just going to buy one? Yes, yes. Uh, your name, please? Uh, it's Graham. Last name? Graham. Graham, Graham, with a G, I assume. I don't see your name on this list. Oh, you did pre-order, right? Uh, pre-order? Oh, yes, this time of year our eyes fly off the shelves. If you haven't pre-ordered, you're out of luck. Our eyes are completely on back order. If you'd like, we can put you on the waiting list for our next shipment. When will that arrive? We get shipments every eight months. I'm afraid that won't work. Well, hang on a sec. It's Graham, right? May we bend your ear for a bit? Bend away. You need an eye for the tournament, I'm guessing. Yes, I have always dreamed of becoming a knight. Why? With Daventry's addendums this and proclamations that, it seems a frightful business. Do you have any idea how many royal guards we lose to that voracious moat monster? Well, yes, my let's get the monster in the moat. My grandfather was a knight, and my great-grandfather... Well, he was a dentist, but his father was a knight. Basically, I come from a long line of protecting crowns. I started looking for knight jobs while I was still in the academy, but once I graduated, all the opportunities had dried up. I might not fit in here, but Daventry's my last shot. Oh, you'll fit in just fine. It might be too late to capture the rule-defined eye of a hideous beast, but rules will pen for those who can outsmart These guys are awesome. Makers. All right, how's the advice again? How much of the candle has a potion coming? Well. So we can dip anything in the cauldron. Be one of thinking. We need something for the candle. And um, the bombs aren't ready. Because all these things we know. <laughs> so we're going to run and grab the pumpkin. See if it'll let us do that now. What is this? Me, this little tree was new in town and needed some time to grow and find its way. What? Too sappy. <laughs> I am we love Grandpa. He'll warm up to it. Um, I don't know if I can't enter. Okay, I can still enter the other shops after this, but we're gonna go see about a pumpkin. See a man about a pumpkin. So, um, it's to the right. Not the pumpkins. Ooh, but we have an interesting statue. Hello. Look at this. Let's go down. No one should notice one bell missing. And then we get the familiar sound. There are things that give you the feels. If King you Edward gave us everything we have. His legacy was tarnished in his later years, but he was a once great man. And he left me with a daventry to grow into the kingdom it is today. Interesting. Um, the announcement board was covered 
until round two of the tournament. And uh, exploring them was part of the reason you didn't get frustrated what previously was a pixel hunt. Um, they were trying to figure out whether or not to integrate arcade into home gaming. Um, and the answer kept being yes. You know, yes, we did want to do this. Um, it led to a lot of just absolutely... That pumpkin was housing That'd too be perfect too. many squirrels for my taste. I might be able to use the bell for the candle. It's tough to say. A small bell. That didn't need a bell. That didn't need a coin. So um, we're going to do a little bit of looking around and then continue onward. Okay, so this should lead back to the training grounds. Or into the deep dark forest. I mean, this is also an option. These are all missing their mouthpieces. How strange. I didn't do it. I am not responsible for the bridge being out. It wasn't me. If anybody asks, it was not this chick right here. You died. You, you, you died. That is not a bridge. No, I really have seen everything. It's it is official. Told you it's not polite to go stomping around on people's backs. Give me one good reason not to gobble you up right now. Because I'm a bridge troll too. Because, because like yourself, dumb ways to I die. Too am a dumb bridge ways troll. to die. See? You're pretty ugly for a troll. A long nose and a bushy tail like that. Are you sure you're not a bridge bandicoot? No. She likes the taste of bandicoot. Where I come from, trolls. Um. Do you like the taste of bandicoot? Or this relationship? Wolfie loves the taste of bandicoot. Well then, I am most certainly a bridge troll. Oh, I'm sorry I didn't believe you. It's just that I've been crossed so many times. One more time, and I might emotionally collapse. Would you be so kind to accept my apology and join me in the secret dance of the Bridge Troll Guild? Of course. Oh, yes, of course, the troll dance. I uh, only know the traditional Ludor version, so you should start. Very well, Tiny Bandicoot. Gonna do a little dance? Get out of trouble this way, you know? Oops. No. I think I know this one. You're no bridge troll. <gasps> so I ask you again. I got an F. I got an F in trolling. You up right now. Okay. I might die okay, here. Let me go. I can return to you with bundles of royal food. You see, I I'm training to be a knight. If you release me, I'll make sure the king rewards you for your troubles. Uh, you're a little scrawny for a knight. Everyone hates my feather. Neck and a silly feather like that. <laughs> Are you sure you aren't a goose? Yes, no. I'm quite sure I am not a goose. I mean, yes. That's exactly what a goose would say. Lucky Mine was the right answer. Right here. The, taste of goose. the feathers are bad for digestion. Now, where do you want from all feet, Goosey? What are those weird instruments? Do you know where I can find them? What are those hide? weird instruments around the bridges? Link in the description below if you do want to play along. Used to summon its associated bridge troll to fill the gap. Also down there is Gamer Grind. Gamer Puppy ships your door. He'll put your logo on merch for like nothing bucks. You can buy the Pirate Queen. Love when you guys send people to our um, channel. Do all sorts of cool things here. So you can buy this chick a coffee at KOFI. One dollar, make me smile. Do you know where I can find an eye? Also down there is Patreon. So if you want to support us on Patreon, we find incredible things in retro gaming. They let you know how gaming developed. This used to be um, arcade heavy, 
So you just still have that mechanic, and I wanted to go grab it and put it back in there, because in addition to filling in the empty, aching half-left by the lack of a Princess Bride reboot, it also shows off certain mechanics in gaming that aren't often used anymore. It is rumored the beast has two purple eyes with bright blue glowing pupils, six legs, three claws, and one tooth. I could let you cross and perhaps even help you with that fire-eyed monster, but since Ulfie didn't eat you, Ulfie needs a pick-me-up. This big tooth is a sweet one. If you bring me something to eat, I'll consider helping you. Can you tell me about Snarlax? Oh my god, we found a Pokemon! Can you share with me why all the bridges seem to be we missing? We get to play with a Pokemon! Right, little goosey. Until they just notice, used to go and get everything that was hilarious. The is officially on strike. For too long have we, the bridges, have been stopped. So link in the description below. Kayla five five is to the coffee. Patreon's down there. All my social my media links. Breaks out in an itchy rash from all that marching. <laughs> so disgusting. As Pilar says, Fox biggest thing is hit subscribe. We're not going Smash the subscribe button. Hit the bell. It'll pop you up a thumbnail of what we're working on. So if you're a huge fan of the Williams, if you're a huge fan of uh, Sierra, and you want to, you know, get the deets, the bridge troll being a friend, a little bit out of the ordinary, the fact that we have to go through the chivalry. Um, this is a complete redo of King's Quest 1. So you can play the remaster that's on our own channel, you can play the original, um, or you can get this one for free. It's a free download. Um, back briskly, Goosey. Is starving. We seem to have collected most of the quests that we're going to need to do. I do want to check out the other shops, which I'll do in the next video. We love you guys. We love that you're always along for it. So definitely hit smash subscribe, smash the button there, and then, like I said, get the updates. So you can check out more Princess Bride style reboot. Um, you can do a little bit more of indie gaming, retro gaming, or like I said, we do cover the blockbusters. I've kind of included this in one of them. We're also doing Shadowrun and Ultima 7 Serpent's Isle. So we're hitting the whole the whole thing, getting it all done. We love you guys. See we love that you're always along for the ride. Makes me miss the old days. <clears throat> we'll see you in the next what? video. No, I was reminiscing. Sorry.